deaf Cubans, 40,000 people face insurmountable challenges. They live in the margins, often alone and forgotten. Many know only their local sign language, further limiting them. Yet, they yearn for God's word. We just came out of a service where we celebrated the completion of the Gospel of Luke in Cuban Sign Language. I don't think I have ever been in a service like that. In total silence, everybody was praising God. The pastor preached a sermon in sign language. If I could preach the way he preaches, with the level of animation and the incarnation of the Word of God, I would be a different person. But more than that, as people received the Gospel of Luke on USB drives, they were deeply moved. Just to see the excitement of people to receive the Bible in a language that they could understand, for me confirmed that, yeah, this is what we do. We enable people to hear God speak. CBS is providing funds for translators to create accurate and verified translations of the Gospel of Luke and the Book of Acts in the Cuban Sign Language. Why don't you join us in what God is doing globally in providing scripture to people who don't have access to scripture? Your support will move this project to the benefit of many thousands more deaf people in Cuba.